Temperatures tonight mostly clear to partly cloudy with a little bit of fog dropping down to the middle 40s, some upper 40s around I-94 and maybe even some lower 40s as you trend north into our far northern communities, Oceana, Nuego, Macosta counties in particular. Those rain showers, as we were mentioning, going to be gone here over the next several hours. Now we can't rule out an isolated shower still hanging around this evening, but the majority of us are going to be dry and we stay dry the entire night tonight. A little bit of fog developing in those clear skies, calmer winds, so some of us could wake up to that tomorrow morning, but a lot of us are just going to wake up to some sunshine. We'll see increasing clouds throughout the morning, and then as we head into the afternoon, we get another band of some heavier showers and thunderstorms. Yes, the chance is out there and probably the best chance of some thunderstorms compared to yesterday. Yesterday was a pretty good chance. I would say we have that similar chance into our Saturday of a few rumbles of thunder, some lightning, maybe some gustier winds with this activity towards tomorrow afternoon. Between 2 and 5 p.m. is when a lot of this activity is going to start to develop and then it continues for the majority of the evening hours. We really won't get a break from the rainfall until we head well into the overnight period. Sunday morning, a few hours overnight uh, Saturday into Sunday. We could have some drier weather, but that system is pretty much just going to lag and linger in the area. So there's not going to be a whole lot of relief even after that colder air starts to trend back on in into our Sunday. That low pressure is going to be directly overhead, so it's going to continue to spin and develop some clouds and showers around for our Sunday and maybe even into Monday and Tuesday. Not going to see a whole lot of difference in the forecast here over the next several days, besides it being milder and the only thunderstorm chance being tomorrow. Rainfall, as we were mentioning, many spots are going to get well over half of an inch. A lot of this is what's going to fall on Saturday. Sunday will be less than a quarter of an inch, but we could see a half of an inch, an inch, maybe a little bit more than that with Saturday's activity. And then we've got a little bit more rainfall on top of it Sunday into Monday, but a lot of that is going to be fairly light. Temperatures tomorrow, 70 to lower 70s. We're back down into the lower and middle 50s on our Sunday, back below normal. Then we jump to around 60 on Monday with a few showers and partly sunny skies. We stay mostly cloudy Tuesday and Wednesday. Can't even rule out an isolated shower or two on both of those days, but because the majority of us are going to remain dry during the middle of next week, we left that chance out of the seven day forecast. However, a chilly high temperature, 49 degrees on Tuesday.